Good evening. It's now uh, 6.30 sharp, Flay High Field, Western Massachusetts, Senior Night, 2018. Shortly, uh, Matt Gillis, uh, Athletic Director, will be announcing uh, the parents and the seniors for this year's Varsity Club. And here they come out onto the field. Craig T. Deitz, ex George Bukovalis, and Michael Gay, who will be participating in today's Good senior evening, evening. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome to Westwood High School's Flay High Field for tonight's Tri Valley League soccer matchup between the Ashland Clockers and the Westwood Wolverines. Prior to tonight's game, we're going to take a moment to recognize our seniors and their parents. So at this time, I'd like to invite the families of our seniors to come on right out onto Flay High Field, please. As you can hear in the distance, Matt Gillis inviting all the senior parents out onto the pitch. Uh, kudos to all the efforts that have been done by the parents to make this evening's uh, festivities uh, something of a, um, a memory for this, these kids. Uh, Sheila Moyle in particular went out of her way to really set up the, uh, the kids beautifully. So bear with us as we get our little pump and circumstance figured out. And as you can see, the Westwood parents making their way out onto the Flay Hive pitch. 70 degrees, uh, October 10th, who would think? Beautiful evening for soccer. Westwood about to uh, commence a match against Ashland, who they beat in their first match this evening, four to two. So, needless to say, the rehearsal did not go off well, and we're going to start all over again. Once again, good evening. I'd just like to take this opportunity to congr congratulate uh, seniors and their families for their uh, four years here at uh, high school and representing our school. Uh, very proud of your accomplishments to this point. Uh, I'd like to wish you good luck in your future endeavors. And now to start off with our seniors. First off, we'll go Clayton Brarin and his parents, Pamela and Craig. Pam and Craig making our way out. I don't know what type of lovely gifts they'll be getting this evening, but uh, awfully nice to have uh, Craig and Pam out there. I can hear a pin drop here at Flay Hive this evening. Next on the line. Next we have Tommy Bukovalis and his parents, Athena and George. There they go. Looks like there's jewelry and a gift certificate. No, not actually sure, the uh, obligatory flowers. So Westwood nodded at four wins Four losses and one tie, really a um, pivotal point in the season to try to turn around the season. Next we have Connor Buckley, his parents Vivian and Kevin. Vivian and Kevin making out to greet their son, Connor Buckley. Lovely embrace. And the photo op. So as we migrate through the various parents and uh, we uh, commence the match, George Bukovalis and Mike Gay will join me for Next the Next we have Eamon Doherty and his mother, Amy. Amy making it to the pitch. Eamon Doherty, versatile player, senior, uh, mostly playing the number nine, kind of a, the uh, attacker role. We'll see what he plays this evening.
And looks like Amy will be leaving the pitch this evening. Not exactly. Next sure. we have Brian Gay and parents Betty and Mike. Betty and Mike making the uh, their way out to greet Brian. And looks like Mike still got Brian by a whisker in the uh, height department. Mike has uh, worked with the Westwood Media Center for a number of years, um, really uh, contributing to the, the town's um, presentation of both basketball and soccer. Next we have Ryan Lewis, parents Carol and Warren. Carol Warren making their way out to uh, Ryan Lewis. Nice little satchel in hand. That's a nice family photo. Next we have Justin Lowe, his parents Irene and Larry. There's Justin making his way out there, Irene. Larry. Very formal this evening, Larry, with that white Oxford shirt. It's very nice. Next we have Kevin Lyons, the parents Katie and Kevin. Katie and Kevin Lyons coming out to salute their son, Kevin Lyons, also a uh, lacrosse player. So after the season ends, they'll be probably migrating into uh, lacrosse mode, albeit spring sport. Very nice. Number of seniors on the squad this year. Next we have Stavros Mikolakos and his parents Anna and Nick. And Nick. Nicolacos, number seven on the Westwood Varsity squad. Stavros is a, uh, a winger, can play on either left or right wing, a versatile player. Again, can hear a pin drop here at Flay High Field this evening. Next we have Josh Morris and Deutsch, parents Cheryl and Carol. Sharon Carroll, always at the matches, it seems. Josh Morrison Deutsch, uh, like Eamon Doherty, a number nine striker. Parents always there to yeah, the extended family, get the kids in there as well. Nice uh, keepsake photo here. So just hoping the boys come out with some vigor this, this evening. Next up we have Jason Moy, the parents May and Brian. May and Brian. Team Moy making their way out to meet their son. Jason is a, um, a winger who's shown um, quite a bit of tenacity this season. Out Next of up, we have Michael Moylan, the parents Sheila and Mike. Michael Moylan, also a co-captain with Tommy Bucavallis, Sheila Moylan, Mike Moylan, and again, um, appreciate all the efforts that Sheila's done this evening to make the festivities grand. And I love that turquoise uh, ensemble that Mike is wearing this evening, Senior Mike. Next up, we have Peter Paravalos and his parents, uh, father, Peter. Peter Paravalos and Pete. Gonna be a showdown.
young Peter. He's got those flowing locks this evening. Hopefully that will uh, translate into a good performance this evening. Next up we have Dan Venture, the parents of Sam and Jeff. Venturas, Dan Ventura, senior, obviously senior night, has been playing the keeper role extremely well. And nice family photo captured on the Westwood Media Center videotape. Next up, we have Kevin Zhang, and their parents, Janju and Dong. Kevin Zhang, who uh, has truly played a strong uh, central role in the uh, back line in this, this campaign. Typically a midfielder, but for the good of the team, has been playing a uh, center back role. So well done, Kevin. Oh, there's going to be a redo. Potential redo here based on the uh, photography. Oh, it's going to be a joint photo capturing all the seniors and their designated parents. Now this is coming off the Red Sox win over the Yankees last night, moving on to the uh, American League Championship Series. It looks very similar to their pose last night. Handsome crew, Dan Ventura making the color palette proper, being in the middle in that lovely orange. And with that, I think, unless we're going to do the national anthem, it appears as though the seed thing. And we just have one more thing before we start tonight's game. We'll just ask the players to head over to the sideline, and we're going to have Westwood High School junior Adeline Ramento. She's going to be singing our national anthem. Fantastic. Always nice to have the performing arts here at the Fly High Field, talented kids throughout this whole entire community. Looks like some parents are getting some autographs on the sidelines, very important people as they say. Oh say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled Fantastic rendition of the National Anthem. Adeline, thank you very much. Excellent job. Good luck to both teams and go Wolverines. And so you have it. Westwood ready to go. Uh, shortly I'll be joined by my co-hosts, Michael Gay, George Bucavallis, 
for their insightful tidbits as we march forward in game number number 10 on the docket. Starting lineup's hard to know, uh, hard to see. With age comes a vision issue, so I'll wait for my colleagues to dial in. Ashlyn, um, I believe, towards the bottom part of the table. Want to welcome Michael Gay to the telecast. Mike um, brought tears to my eyes as I saw you enter the pitch. George Bukovels also joining the telecast. Uh, prior to you coming up to the uh, crow's nest here, I mentioned the fact this is a, a critical juncture in the, the season of the, uh, the Westwood Lads. It is. <coughs> it is. Uh, so hello, everybody. Uh, kind of a, an emotional night, senior night, for uh, all of those parents that have either gone through it or, uh, or, or will in the future. It's uh, you know, a lot of hard work, <coughs> a lot of practices, early morning, club, club soccer, um, thinking back to kindergarten soccer. It's been a fun journey. So uh, welcome, welcome, George, and congratulations to you, George. Uh, thank you, Michael. What a beautiful night. Uh, I can't believe four years have gone by. Um, like you said, very emotional night. Hopefully the boys come out and uh, give us a, uh, a really big show. A big show, a good show. So I, I, I mentioned prior to you guys joining me, and I tried to add some commentary about the uh, Team Book of Alice and the Moylan's fantastic senior night job uh people take it for granted but uh, a lot of banners balloons festivities well done and we here we are uh, we had a fly bite too uh, yeah the, the the uh the f-15s, F-15s they just <laughs> get made a buzz <coughs> i don't know if you caught that did you catch it on the camera we i did not i, okay. I was uh, my my tripod could not go to the heavens <laughs> so as you mentioned uh craig definitely a big game for the for the uh, westwood team and they really need to take two points. Um, you know, coming out with anything less would be a letdown. Uh, they pretty much um, handled Ashland uh, first game of the season. Um, gave up a couple of late goals, and so momentum s- somewhat shifted. But they were the better team. Uh, and early, you've got Kevin Lyons making a run down the down the right nice side. Ball. Nice, nice job. Run. Put a nice flat ball across. Oh, beautiful. Very yeah. Nice. Nice very, up. very nice. So, just want to get your thoughts on. The fact that you're meeting a squad for the second time in the season, what can we, what can we expect? What are some natural tendencies? Well, if you remember the first game they played, both teams started off a little tight, <coughs> and then Westwood broke through. Um, goals by Bukovalis and Tidites uh, early um, kind of set the tone. Uh, you know, I think Ashland, you know, Ashland's a, not a not a bad team, so you you got to you got to take them seriously. Um, you got to do the things that got you here. Um, I, I, I do think Westwood is the better better side. So if they can if they can play their game, put some passes together, I think they'll be fine. So I think they'll make some adjustments in the midfield because our goals were actually scored right down the middle of the uh, the park, if you if you recall. Now, just a commentary. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, all uh, players on the pitch right now are all seniors. Well, that's Ooh. a nice play. Ooh. Dan Ventura. Where they come out? Yeah. I believe you're right. We have all seniors. Yep. Yeah, and that's, um, you know, typically you've got Michael Tidite starting, so it's a, <coughs> you know, kind of a tip uh, tip of the cap to the seniors for all their hard work. Um, it's a oh, no, you would classy, classy it. move, yeah. absolutely, by uh, John Grant. But let's, let's see how the boys can ratchet up the intensity. And that is onside. That is onside. Oh. That was a Close tough call. call. Yep. So uh, shout out to the the junior varsity team that were uh, had a previous match. Five two, I believe, was the final. Five, five two. They look good. They have uh, looks like they have some finishing prowess, which has uh, been our Achilles' heel this season. Yeah, putting it in the back of the net is uh, you know you need somebody somebody to step up, be aggressive and. The JV is certainly doing that. Hopefully, uh, you'll see a lot of that tonight with uh, the, the varsity side. So, uh, Tommy Bukaval is back from injury. Ooh. Yeah, he shot three games out with an ankle injury. Um, says he feels a lot better. We'll see how he plays tonight. Yeah, there was, uh, nice turn. you know, surprising to see him miss that last game. I thought he might, uh, ooh, geez, and he just goes down hard. <coughs> uh, surprising to see him miss that last game. I, I thought... Uh, 
we might see him in action, but you know, there's no sense in rushing it back because you know, if you if you have a lingering injury, it's just going to haunt you for the rest of the season. Well, I don't think they get they have given him clearance for that particular game, even though he. Yeah, he go. he he needs to get a hundred percent well for the stretch run. Nice, nice play. It's a but nice ball, nice through ball, beautiful. And Stavros Mikalakos on the far Stavros? side. That is George. Stavros? George. When we say Stavros, we don't want to say Mikalakos. Yeah, Stavros or Josh? That's Josh out there. No, that was number. F yeah, that's Josh. Oh, I take it back. Okay, Josh sorry. Josh is on the left side today. I take it back. So Stavros, uh, Stavros actually not starting, but I'm sure we'll see see him shortly. Um, Stavros Mikalakos. We joke. Uh, George Bukovalis, fellow Greek, says it much better than we can. Ooh. Dan nice. taking that Ventura Highway and getting that ball out of the zone. Okay, Westwood definitely, uh, you know, starting slow again. They're, uh, you know, you can't take this team lightly. All it takes is one uh, well-placed through ball, and you're looking at a 1-0 deficit. Nice play. Is that? That's Clayton Brown. Yeah. Nice job. Brian Gay gets the ball out. We gotta go to the ball. Go to that ball. Go in hard. A little too strong. Heavy touch. Well, so pr before you get to it, I already made my commentary about the exquisite weather this evening, the 10th of October, 2018, and glorious 70 degree weather. I, are you sure it's October, not August? <laughs> Indian summer. We have it. And not to lay fun of the Hurricane Michael, but I'm hoping that he, that Hurricane Michael does come onto the pitch. Yeah, waiting eagerly. Uh, that's a nice nice ball. Let's get to the Tommy Bukovall strong header to win that ball, sending a message. So the ball's just in the air way too much for our liking right now. Oh, I thought it might go through to Eamon Doherty. <coughs> so again, for those of you just uh, catching your first game, uh, these are three dads. We're homers. <coughs> we'll try to be positive. Uh, we've got two of the three of us that actually know what they're talking about from a soccer perspective. I have no clue, but I pretend. Oh, I thought you say something about George. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, breakdown here from Westwood. Nice job by Clayton Brown. Steps up. Bring it down. Yeah, it's a bit of a feeling out process, I would say. It's a nice ball. Come out, Dan. Come out. There you, there go. you go. Sure hands uh, Luke it. out there. Roll it. Yeah, we can hear Daniel ordering everybody to get up. He's going to do a... That's a function of, uh, I hate to say, credit to me as I yelled in his ear tonight saying, please be vocal. Get up. Get there up. There we go. It's a nice ball. Here's uh, Jason Moy. Jason Moy. Also, also commented. Nice job. Kevin Lyons, the dipsy do on the line. Ooh, he gets taken out. No call. Well, that's the way we need to play, a little bit physical on our end as well. Nice flat ball back to Daniel Ventura. Big switch. Yep. Nice skill set there by Brian Gay, marching the ball, push the ball up, okay. Gets taken down from behind. A I didn't see that. Yeah, it was a good, uh, good clean, you know, well, not clean, well, <laughs> it was a foul, but. The, uh, <laughs> the young lad from uh, Ashland, um, Offering a hand offering, to uh, offering a hand that's all gamesmanship because he's gonna probably try to take him out the next. Yeah. <coughs> hard ball, hard ball for. Get back to him. Go through. Nice job. Kevin Zhang, one of the other seniors. I mentioned uh, again. I'm repeating myself for those who watch the video, but I mentioned that. Kevin has really given up uh, kind of his natural position as a midfielder to shore up the back line. So uh, Justin Lowe's back in the lineup as well. Uh, was he out there for the last few games? As That's well? a mistake. Okay. Nice play back. Nice. Oh, my God. Oh, jeez. That almost uh, was, well, uh, was Mike, one. <laughs> Mike, just one comment. Uh, when we're talking about high school sports, we can't bring in school and religion, okay? <laughs> so let's just keep Did I say, oh, God? Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, I was just uh, talking oh to my uh, higher power. Oh my Golly gosh. gee is acceptable. Good, goodness, Anything in that. Goodness gracious. Yeah. Okay. As you mentioned, uh, first goal, critical. Let's see. Westwood working on their set plays. 
Okay, nice job. Is so Bukovalis comes out of the pack. Bukovalis is getting mauled. Okay, and he's got nice ball. ball. What a play by number eight for uh, Ashland. There you go. Eamon Doherty pushes it forward. Nice job. Yeah, that's a tough play, that ball coming back to Daniel Ventura, because he can't pick it up, and it's a bouncing ball. You've got to get your whole body in front of it, just stop it. Now, you've got a defender coming at you, so it's actually not a terrible result for the ball to go out of bounds. I thought it might have got through and gone in the net, right. which would have been disastrous. But That sounds outstanding justification for your comment. <laughs> and again, I've got absolutely no idea what I'm talking about. but uh, Just want to pin you down, Michael. You just want your defender to have confidence in you, moving the ball back, right? So yep. <coughs> just need to get in front of the ball. Okay, there's a little bit of a break here. Justin Lowe, he's got number seven, making a streak. He will get there. Got to get gold side. Gold That's side. a nice job. That's going to be a corner kick. So two corner kicks, second one coming here for uh, Ashland. Ashland, uh, you know, coming out here, and um, you know, regardless of what the first first game score was, they're they're trying to impose their will on Westwood. Let's watch the. Uh, you know, I don't want to get too stu superstitious, but uh, you know, these new kits that they're wearing, uh, which AKA uniforms, uh, haven't served them well. They've worn it once, and they got. Um, they got a shellacking. Yeah, you know, I'm not going to blame the laundry. I mean, like, you know, that's a, the sample size is too small, Craig. Okay. You know, if we come out here and lay an egg, okay. then okay. then we might burn them. Okay, Mr. Status. We got another big one. What Friday <laughs> as well with the kit. So you get the Dover Sherborne. Dover Sherborne, top of the table in their uh, in their division. In the small. Are they top Try or no, Medway? No. I think Medway overtook them. Now. Did they really? Okay, that, I, I might be there's dated. A, there's yeah. a, I believe, a game to today, Norton against Medway. That will be interesting to see how they pan out. Nice flick on by Josh. Eamon running onto it. Ooh, jump it. Ooh. Step on. Nice. That's a nice, That's a nice ball. ball. Dan nice Ventura. Ball. Nice ball. Okay, yeah. That That's was the way uh, to come out. That's what you want from your goalkeeper. Yep. Being yeah. aggressive. Being anticipating. So that was a very nice ball. Mike, uh, how are ticket sales tonight? Ticket sales are pretty pretty heavy for senior night. I would say somewhere between twelve and thirteen thousand. Uh, fans in the in the stands. Mm -hmm. uh, we were busing busing uh, <coughs> families in, quite frankly, from different parts. Nice. Yeah, we want to thank the people. Want to thank the people at the senior center for allowing that parking. Absolutely, the senior center, um, the middle school. Oh, nice, nice ball. ball. Oh, man, yeah. He ran through. I thought it might be off. I mean, it was close. Yeah, it was a it was, was a close very angle. Close. So the senior center. We've got uh, buses parked in the maze. There's uh, it's crazy. I know uh, for those folks who are tuning from outside the region, the maze refers to the adjacent neighborhood. Yes. Ooh, nice. Dangerous Come play. Nice play. Put that across. Too heavy. Okay, composure, boys. Composure. Nice job by... Brarin. They're all bunched up. They're all bunched up in the middle. We just need to use both sides of the field. George, at any time, please yell switch. Uh, I've given you the green light. That's what we need, a big switch. I think there might have been a uh, Kevin Lyons might be bleeding. So he is uh, heading off to get some medical attention. In comes another senior, that's Ryan, Ryan Lewis. Ryan Lewis, a three-year varsity player. Also coming out of the maze. Absolutely. I think there's a bus in his driveway. Nice throw in. Nice throw. Go all the way back. See, we keep going on the same side. That's, a, that's not good. Okay, oh. come up, come up, come up, come up, come up. Come outside, on. outside. That's it, Brian. Great nice play. Nice job. Great play. 
by Brian Gay there. Shoulders. Nice job. See, that's what you like so to see with Westwood. Nice control. I, I, I do like that, Mike, but what I, I don't, what I want to see is a little bit more urgency in the back. So it's one thing to control it, but next is let's move it, let's be positive and move the ball forward. Okay, that's a nice one, too. Okay, you know, some aggressive play by Clayton Brown. Nice way to attack the ball. Nice shoulder to shoulder play, nice no call. I apologize uh, as I'm whipping the monitor back and forth to capture the essence of this match. <laughs> nice job. Like, Nice first touch. There we go. Again, nice. nice one, two. Oh, you had him on the wing, on the wing, on the wing, on the wing. Step into that. Okay. Again, mind you, we're, we're, we're perched about, you know, 40 feet up in the air. We can see the totality of the field. These guys are, uh, unfortunately, have to look through all the wickets. Continuity is an issue, gentlemen. We're not it seeing right it. Right now, we need uh, Mr. Tedites into the game. String some some passes together and move forward. That's yeah, going to be a goal kick, right? It's going to be another uh, corner oh, kick. I think that's the right call. Really? That was uh, yeah, off of uh, Kevin Zhang. So um, third corner. So you, you you claim we are homers, but in that case. Uh, nah, you know that was a that was a tough play. Kevin, uh, you know, bouncing ball. He was trying to trying to make something happen. You know, you don't want to get beat there. You know, there's, you get beat, and nobody's. Nobody's back behind. Nice win by Brian Gay there. Oh, gets his pocket picked. Comes back into the play and breaks it up. Yeah, that's okay. I, I mean, it's, it's, it's a game of imperfection, but the fact that if you do lose the ball. Get back in and make yeah, up for it. Exactly. Tell you, there's nothing <coughs> as infuriating as a coach of, you know, the hanging your head and, you know, feeling bad for yourself when somebody goes in and in any sport. In all walks of life. Absolutely. If you have a tough meeting, you, you know, you pick yourself up and you, you get them next time, right? Dust it all right, so who do you have got? You got Clayton, oh, uh, no. Connor Buckley. Connor Buckley on. made his way onto the pitch. Peter Paravalos is on. I think there's number seven on the far side, George. Who's that? That would be Mr. Michalakos. Stavros. So Peter playing, is he, play, is he playing a wing? Ooh, slide it. Ooh, Ooh, Tommy almost had him. Okay, let's calm it down. That's there you go. There you go, boys. Now let's be more positive. Nice ball. Stretch the field. That's what we need. Work up. Ryan Lewis, I think Ooh. he won the court, the uh, throw in, no? No, he did not. He did not, and and a, a play like that—it's a good shield by the by the defender. But if they're going to shield that way, in my mind, they need to know your name. Um, you give them a little bit of contact there. Uh, I feel that you know, as a team, we tend to shy away from some of that. We need to see that in the second half of the season. That ball, ball bop. Yeah. Be a throw in for Westwood. Going to be a retrieval by the keep. Twenty. Uh, let, let's see if we can win this ball in the air. Twenty-two minutes and uh, forty-five seconds to play here in the first half. Westwood and Ashland, no score. I believe at Ashland, first uh, game of the year, we were about uh, two nil at this point. Westwood. So Ashland playing a better brand of soccer. Uh, I know in that first game they were missing a couple of their uh, couple of their better players. Oh, is that was that the folklore you got from the parents, the uh, yeah. Ashland parents? It was. Yeah, I'm not lead. seeing a tremendous change. Nice step. Oh, nice, oh, nice try, Peter. At least he's going forward that ball. I like that. Turn and go. Uh, we, we, there's nobody on our wings, well, so we're I jamming see, the middle of the we, park, we George. We're just bunching up in the middle. Yeah, there's exactly. No, there's no side to side play. No, we need we need width. As players, not as you know. Yes, good talk. Young adults yes, like ourselves, yes, yes. old men. 
Oh, man, I, I, the last thing I need is width. I, I have trouble getting into my jeans as it is. Ooh. Nice switch by Ashland. It's a nice ball movement. I like that. It's a nice play. Connor breaking up that ball. And Peter Paravlos, he's happier the more he runs, I think. He's got a... Uh, got an engine. He's got, he's got definitely the AAA uh, battery engine, yep. There you go, Connor. There you go. That's a nice ball. Okay. Ooh. Ryan Lewis trying to need somebody to support him. Tommy Bukovala strong. Yeah, again. There you go. Uh, I just, I, one of these through balls are going to actually be successful for Ashland. It's a great slide tackle by Ashland, far side. Sooner. These passes just have to happen sooner. We're just holding on to that ball. We're not, that last touch so needs to be better. So five substitutions in for Ashland. We could pretend we know their names, but we don't. I have it on here. Oh, do you really? Yeah. Nice. I think you can see that far. So while we're uh, while you're looking that up, oh, oh here we go. No, I, I don't. I didn't really care. I was just making it sound like I did. Well, then you're making me use more <laughs> battery life on my phone. Which <laughs> um, so uh, as we're as we're watching here, just a quick shout out to Westwood Media Center. Uh, we leverage all of their equipment um, and we film all of the games that we can make it to, uh, which is most of them. We missed a couple, but uh, is that IT speak? Leverage their equipment? No, not necessarily. Yeah, I always thought it was borrow. No, we're leveraging it. I mean, we're not. Oh, geez, it gets oh, taken call. down. Nothing. No call. It's right in front of the okay. official. Uh, so I know. Peter, th he went down a little bit like a sycamore there. He was uh, a little bit theatric. He peeks into the extreme sport, so, you know, he may have just sold, tried to sell somebody. Nobody home for Westwood? Knock, knock. Step in. There, there you go. go. Connor's been playing very well on that uh, right back. Take it, Tommy. This is where Tommy scored. The this is where he scored. Oh, too heavy. Uh, well, left foot. Touch. Oh. Great play by the keeper. Have a shot. Have a shot. Why not? Okay, nice job by Westwood. Okay, nice play. That's okay. actually very similar to the way Tommy Bukavala scored. Oh, he hit his ankle again. Ah, uh, crap. He got stuffed. He got stuffed. Yeah, he's a bit gimpy. That is not good for Westwood. Oh man. It was right foot. It was the right play. You know, you're coming in. Uh, the keeper just made you know made a great play on him. I'll tell you that's the second year where we've had issues with Ashland. Uh, if you remember last year, um, Eamon Doherty was uh, was injured in the last, uh, was it the last game of the year? One of the last games of the year. So, bummer for uh, for Tommy Bukvass. Hopefully it's just a, uh, a cramp and... Uh, T-dites on. Yeah, we got T-dites in, so you, you know, you're going from effectively one... Uh, nice ball, get in there. Nice job by the keeper Ooh, coming out. More of that. Come up hard. Oh, you can't turn Ooh. your back. Ooh, you can't out. turn your yeah. back, guys. Um, George, no, again, I'm no. still a proponent of the one-day George uh, Bukovala's defensive uh, they skills. They just need to go in there high and just win it clean. But, you, but I'm just saying you can't, you got to square up. You square can't up. turn yep. your back. I don't. I, much of that. Yeah, I don't have a problem. I don't even have a problem with that foul. I mean, it, you know, but it's it, you're right. It was it, you're, you're too late to the play, and you're um, turning your back to the ball. Nice job okay, by Michael Tudor. Settle, settle in, uh, who's that? Parabolos. <coughs> He's. Ooh, and there's a mistake. Nice uh, recovery by number 20 for uh, Ashland. 28, excuse me. Number 28, uh, no name. 28. Oh, we're gonna call him Bill. I have a. Uh, I have all the listings of all their team. Yeah. But you don't want nah, them. just don't. Don't particularly nice care. Ball. That's another nice ball. Little heavy. Actually, I'm just kidding. I do care. Let me uh, take a look, and I'll give you a quick rundown of who number 28 is. Now I feel bad. Might have insulted him and his family, and. 
So that was a very nice play by number 28 for Medfi or for excuse me for Ashland, and this is there's no 28. So I you know what it, well, it, it ends at 25. Well, we may have to ask. You know what, uh, we're just gonna <laughs> ask uh, Mr. Gillis to check off these numbers, see if there's some Legal. cook in the books. <laughs> Ryan Lewis, ooh, nice the turn. old twisto. A nice play. A uh, nice Connor has nice been soft, very well. Soft foot nice by Connor. Play. Nice ball. Let's see what we could do in the midfield. Nice. Give it to him. We got it. Ooh, he was off. Heavy. Yep, uh, Michael T. Dites was off, so no attempt to go for the ball there. All it would do is cause an offsides call. Which would have pretty much given them the ball right around when they're going to get the free kick. But so we'll have a chalk talk at uh, halftime to see what kind of adjustments need to be made. Um, is the hustle there? Yeah, I, I don't. I don't think the hustle is lacking. Um, I think you know Ashton just coming out and playing a better better game. We just need to be crisper. I mean, ooh, they get uh, Kevin Lyons for the hold. No, that would be. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, Michael. Uh, Anytime they see the hands up, they automatic whistle. I, I, what's uh, Coach Grant saying? Not sure. We'll something take it. About something, go on and take it. Make it, take it. If you make it. You take it. Nice ball. That's the ball. Right there. T Dites to Stavros. Let's see what we can get here. Ooh. Okay. Oh, wow. deflection. I don't know if he was trying to pass that or toe poke that. I think he tried to toe poke. You know, but. For those at home, toe poke is a means of when you're extending that leg, be it right or left, to try to uh, poke it into the uh, to that. Corner kick. Here we go. First of the evening. The Pukovalis is getting ready to come back in. Oh, they shrugging it off. With oh, that. yeah. Kevin I mean, Lyons the um, the um, quarter zone shot that they have here on the sideline. Well, here is a header. Oh, there it is. Oh, Oof. we gotta go to these balls. Attack the balls. Put it in the middle. Put it back on net. There we go. So a nice hustle by Ryan Lewis. A little bit late to the spot. He's so definitely doing the hustle. Do the hustle. Okay, so that's the first. First uh, music reference by Craig T. Dites. One of probably 23 to 24 during this telecast. Oh, uh, if, if you, if you, uh, I mean. Uh, you can do it. I mean, that, 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 oh, that, could, be a, that, could, that could be a challenge. I can clearly trump that number. Paravalos, who's just like a bear on. Let's go. Look, look, at, look at the space on the other side if we switch the ball. That's nice. Okay. Mm. That's fine. Okay, All right, now fine. let's just get our shape. Nothing wrong there. Now we don't need to rush. There we go. Other side. Let's keep it. Find someone. Moreland wide open. Okay, over the top. That's off. Yep, that was uh, about two to, two to three yards off sides. Good call by the far official. we got Willie Nelson playing in the backfield for Ashland. <laughs> <laughs> to all the players that I've played before. That's two. Okay. Nice. Nice turn by Peter Paravos. Oh, too uh, heavy. Yeah. You Let's know what? See, those are the balls that we need Un to Understood, keep. but uh, and that is a swing and a miss. That's a up, sc up you go. Nice. Ooh. Nice win. Nice job by Bukovalis. Testing that ankle right after he get, gets back in the game. Nice, nice cut. move. Nice cut. There you go. Beautiful. Oh, he's calling the off. There's no way the he's offside. offside. Again, right in front. Well, you she's know what? on the line, so yeah. she's sorry. Okay, yeah. so I took Umbridge with a ref last year. How 
that he was not offside. I'm going to go back to the tape. <laughs> I think the angle's a little tough here, but uh, if, if, if she's missing a call that close, then... Oh, no, they, but remember, I, I kept saying that last year they missed three calls, which are goals, because p poor... Ooh. Ooh, that's playing with fire in, in your end. Okay, that's... It happens. Look, yep. at, look at the Sox game two nights ago. Don't... Uh, right? Angel Hernandez missed three calls. Nice job. Connor Buckley. Yeah, that that is. Oh, he gets taken nice. down. You blow the whistle there, sir. Oh, we've got the ball. We'll take, look, it's going to be a better turn. Step. Nice Leading job. Kevin. Beautiful, but no one's there. No one home. So, again, nice job by Connor Buckley. Connor Buckley stepping up in this, you, in this game. I tell you, to play that level of defense in the box, jeopardizing a potential. PK, PK. Well, he was the one that got taken got taken down. But you're right. I mean, you're you're, you're you know, one one wrong uh, swipe of the foot there, and it's a PK. Well, this does not bode well for uh, for an evening with. There we go. To Michael. Ooh. Don't leave your feet, boys. If you're not, if you're gonna slide tackle, you gotta win it. Yeah, Brian Gay coming in with a little bit of a some hip hip action there. Coming in strong. So Ashland's playing a three-five-two gentleman. Let me they're flooding the midfield. That's why uh, our boys just don't have the time that they usually have. Okay. So at, at what right? point, George? At what point do you you gonna put Michael Michael T. Dates up top? Well, well, I mean, if they've got two in the two two in the back, I mean, they've got amazing. Got three in the back. We've got three in the back, and then we got caught there. Okay, I was looking down there. I thought there were only two in the back. Yeah, so three in the back. You're gonna see Michael stop pushing forward. We, we need that, we need our big boys to uh, generate some offense here. Oh, nice ball. Balls in. Balls in. There you go. Handball. Ooh. Yep. Did he call hand or did he call no, out? Just a throw in. Just throw in. Well. He didn't have the uh, advantage Back of being. He didn't up. have the advantage of being up here in the heavens. Yeah, he was shielded. That was a. That would have been a tough call. Nine. Uh, nine minutes and fifteen seconds left. First half. Um, not many. Nice hustle, we Justin Lowe, and that's going to be a foul. West foul, free kick late foul. Late. So that's a good call. They're going to take the short one. Step in. No, that's good. You know what? I like the way Connor's playing. He's forcing them. He, I like the way he's playing aggressive defense. Square him up. Nobody behind you there. I don't. Uh, I don't disagree with that. That play. The, we, Westwood's just going to move the ball faster. Nice play. Get that ball out of there. Oh my God! You guys got to attack the ball. They're okay, so the guys just sit there and they watch the whole. Yeah. They watch the ball in the air again. I'm gonna. You know, th okay. that's a tough one. But you know what? It's one goal. Let's be positive. That was a that was a poor defensive play, um, wow. but it uh, you know can't define who you are as a team. Westwood struggling out of the gate here. One nil to Ashland. Seven fifty two to play here in the first quarter. The ball bounces in the middle. You need to get ahead on that ball. To not go after that is tough. No, but no, oh, the problem is we're not, we, there's no reason why we're not controlling this midfield. This is just I'm not going to say it's. Um, well, I'll just be quiet. Josh Morris and Deutsch into the game for Westwood. What do you say? Get rid of the ball. 
Yeah, that is how um, Bukovala scored in the in the first Ashland game. Ooh. So yeah, a bit of a downer here on uh, senior night, but I think Westwood uh, still certainly in this game. The next goal, as important as the first. Push up, push up. We've got the ball. Let's go. If the ball's in. Michael, what are you doing? He played it. We're going to make a run, Kevin Lyons. Far yeah, side. Let's not do long ball. Let's just not do long ball. I mean, it's just giving the ball away. Let's build it up. You you have the ability to build it up. Am I, am I wrong? Well, you're a little, yeah, you're right. But at, at the same time, you know, they, they're, well, we they're need, playing we, the ball up. We need to stretch the field. I mean, we, we just bunching up. It's Josh Morrison Deutsch. Quicker. Got to be quicker. Got to be quicker. Got to be quicker. And it's going to be a uh, foul right outside the box. Oh, they're giving the foul even though we had the ball. That's a shocker. You know, if you're Westwood, though, you can capitalize on this. Michael, uh, looks like either Tudites or Bukovalis will take the free. See if they go uh, go short here or try to put one in the top left. I would let one rip here. Yeah. We haven't tested the keeper yet. Ooh, Oof, nice, nice dip, ball. Nice dipping shot. Yeah, about a foot and a half too high, but uh, nice attempt. Five minutes and ten seconds to play here in the first half. Westwood trails Ashland 1-0. So another uh, Wednesday, short Wednesday for the Westwood boys. They have a, uh, I think they haven't won on a short Wednesday in probably the last six years. Do, do, uh, the Westwood's one, two, and one at home, by the way. What did they say? Football, protect the house or something? The we house. must protect this house. Yeah. Well, you got to win the home games. Yeah, I mean. You got to win the home games. They've got some big ones coming up. Quickly. Big switch. What's it? It's going to be offsides. So, four minutes, ten seconds to play. Westwood, let's see if they can scratch one out before the uh, end of the half here. Go in, knot it up at one. No energy here, zero energy. We're, tr we're trying to play cute soccer, and it, and it doesn't work in high school, We've gentlemen. Just been giving balls away. Right, it's, it cute soccer doesn't away. work. I mean, these balls, we're just giving them the ball. Getting pushed off. It's gonna be a foul. Got pushed off, but yep. he was more physical than than our guy. That's what's happening. Nice ball. To Ashland coming off a, uh, not a little too much, uh, Ashland coming off a 2-1 loss to Dover Sherburn. So, again, Ashland playing a much better brand of soccer. I see they're playing compact, they're not giving our guys any room in the middle. They're suffocating them. They uh, lost to Norton High School 2-1. to one. <laughs> get, Got to get the, get the ball to the playmakers. Get the ball to the playmakers. Nice, Brian Gay. Nice. You see how Ashland's just hustling all over the yeah, field. Yeah, like I said. Yeah. Oh, now something. Some, do something with this. Now make a run. That's not the ball. Up strong. Have a rip. Have a hit. Nice ball. Oh. Mm, nice deflection at the very last second by Ashland. Lights. 
pass wide open. Let's go. So we're trying to take men in. Right? Well, they are so, getting fouled. Yeah. So th they are taking away the midfield on us, but it seems like we're, we're trying to take that man, that, that first man on in the midfield, and it's just not working today. So a couple of scores as I'm looking through the uh, Ashland scores. They, uh, I'll tell you, been <laughs> they uh, lost to Holliston at Holliston, one nothing. They drew uh, Nor Norton. I'm sorry, Norwood. Turn that. Nice ball. Ooh. You didn't expect it back. We are under two minutes, so the scoreboard goes to, it reads two, and final two minutes are kept down on the field by the near official. Connor, up you go. Again, again, Bright. There you go. That's that should be wet. Well. I, I thought I thought I glanced off of uh, Ashlyn. Is she calling a foul? Or is she calling? She, she's calling. Oh no, substitution. Substitution. Okay. No, it's just a throw-in. It's not a foul. It's Jack Flaherty for Ashland. Oh, my God. Ooh. That should, there you go. Foul. That's got to be the end of this half. I, I would assume he's going to kick it and he's going to blow the whistle. So, you know, if you're Westwood, you, you certainly started off tight. You started off slow, senior night, lots of emotions for the, for the boys out there. You know, you hope that uh, Grant can have a uh, Newt Rockney speech at halftime. Is that Don? No, I don't think that's... Uh, or somebody sneezing. Yeah, that might have been somebody sneezing away. Sounded like the donger. Okay, that's a little bit of skew. I think he's gonna keep it in. Nope. Yeah, it was. Oh, that's got to be it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it. You're gonna, you're gonna call it. You're just not, you're not gonna wait for the, uh, for the no. whistle on the field. I think it's. Uh, I mean, is there any stoppage time here? I would. Well, think not. you know, Tommy did get injured. There was a little bit of a break there. Maybe. Yeah, I, I agree with that one. Just getting that out of, out of, uh, out of dodge. It's dangerous. You need to go to these balls. Well, the problem is you you, you, you have a you have an offensive player playing. Not going yeah. at these balls, and that's a nice hit. Why not? And this should do it. He's looking at his wrist. Okay, let's see if you're Westwood. You got another run here. Just put it up top. Put it up top. You got nothing to lose here. You got about ten seconds to go here in the first half. Oh, he had him. He had him. He had him. His head was down. Yep. Yeah. So Westwood trails 1-0 to Ashland at the end of the first half. Not the start and senior night that these boys were looking for, but we've got 20 minutes of soccer, excuse me, 40 minutes of soccer remaining. We'll be back in what is, what will feel like us to us about 10 minutes, but to you it's about, what, 10 seconds. And we're back. Westwood trails Ashland 1-0 here at Flayhide Field in Westwood. Ashland will control here in the second half, and they're going to go with a, a long run right out of the gate. And just getting pushed right off the ball, that's going to be a foul on number 11. Nice uh, aggressive play. You know, you try to get away with it there. But uh, the referee was on the spot. Maybe a throw in for Ashland. Peter Pravalos in the back right there, or back left, excuse me. Throw in. Passes need to be crisp or our passes just aren't there. Ball's bouncing again. Wow. Um, and we're shying away from the head balls again. Yeah, 
And that's going to be a deflection. It's going to be a Westwood ball. Um, you know, Jack uh, Flaherty is a very strong player, but uh, uh, it goes down on the ground and still comes up, gets the ball back. Yeah, you want a, a different level of uh, intensity here. There's uh, Jason Moy. Again, t to the other team. That's going to be a throw in. I mean, a, excuse me, a corner kick. And so that was a really nice play by the, I believe it was number 11 on the, f on the far side. He, Peter Paravalos made contact with it, and then he just shielded him and, and drew, the, drew the throw in. I mean, excuse me, the uh, corner kick. So this will be the, I want to say the fourth corner. Westwood has done a nice job. Maybe the fifth. Um, Westwood has done a nice job to date. 1-0 early here in the second half. Mike Gay, George Bukovalis. Win that in the air. Wow. Wow. Westwood struggling uh, with, with corner kicks for, for most of the year. Corner kicks, throw-ins uh, in the, uh, in the uh, Norton game. Still giving them nightmares. But they dodge a bullet. Michael Moylan coming over the top and trying to send it through. Traffic. Nice job by, that was Brian Gay. Well, there's a nice through ball. Here he comes. Stavros Mikalakos, number seven, near side. Justin Lowe will throw the ball in for Westwood. He'll get it into Clayton Brown. Nice switching of the field. Josh Morrison Deutsch. There's Bukabalas. Oh, I thought he might <coughs> dot through there. Jack Flaherty for Ashland. Pushed it off to the side. They got uh, okay, good defensive form. Nice job by Peter Parabolos. Go, go far side, far side. Nice ball. That's a nice ball. Right to goal, right to goal, right to goal, right to goal. Ah. Well, give that ball. Give it. Yeah, so you're We're cutting. we release the ball. That's going to be a foul. They've got the ball. Yeah, that's frustrating. I mean, a nice job. Nice ball up there. Um, Stavros Mikolakos made a nice attempt to cut it back, but um, the play just took too long to develop. Um, I didn't see if there were streaking players on the far side, if anybody showed. But um, Oh, they had Josh wide open waiting for the ball. Um, talking about a previous offensive play. Yep. So Westwood dodges another bullet. 35 minutes to play here in the second half. Westwood trailing 1-0, looking for a spark, any spark. Yeah, it's a tough play. Looks like... Uh, Michael T. Dites will come back into the game for Westwood. Hey, 
Actually, take it back. That's Kevin Zhang. He's going to come in for Clayton Brown, and that'll move. Uh, I think they'll kill, still keep uh, Brian Gay as one of the center back positions. <laughs> that was an illegal throw. Brian comes in. Nice ball by Stavros. Here we go. Now we got something here. Right through. It's uh, it's on. It's on. Just a little too much. A little too heavy there. Yeah. Nice idea though. Come up hard. Oh, that's a <laughs> getting moved off the ball. Nice ball. Okay, Stavros, get 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 something. Get something. Get something. Be there. Oh, and it gets taken down. But made contact with the ball first. So a nice slide tackle by the keeper. They'll bring Kevin Lyons in on the far side for Ryan Lewis. Justin Lowe on the near side will throw the ball in for Westwood. Nice ball. Jack Flaherty too strong in the middle. It's going to be Michael Moylan who's going to look to uh, get a big throw in. Nice ball. Nice throw. Oh, what's the call there? That's a, uh, I went up and I had a defensive player come under me and I wasn't able to fall down, so the foul was on me. That's awful. Awful. Yeah. There might have been a grasp or something else, but I, I think uh, I would agree that that was a, a tough call for Westwood. But let's see if they can come out and... Nice, nice header. A little flick. Get the ball down. Nice ball. Go right through him. Go right through him. Keep working on it. Nice shield by the uh, Ashland defender. Does this look like it's recording here? Yep, we're good. Okay. REC up top here, we're good. We're having a little uh, audio uh, technical, audio visual Just didn't see check the, there. the uh, numbers moving, Michael. Yeah, that's good. So. Yeah, that freaks you out the far right. Yeah. yeah. Fascinating uh, television as you watch this here. I'll tell you, you know, it's another game where Ashland just has an intensity that Westwood doesn't have. I agree. How boys think that they can just uh, flick a switch, but it's not how it works. Gotta put in the work. Ooh. Another throw in for Ashland. Another throw in for Ashland, and I'll tell you, don't fall asleep here. Green ball. Green throw. Yeah, it was an illegal throw. Illegal throw by Ashland. We'll take it any way we can get it, George. Legal throw, or either that or the original call was no, it was, ball. It was, no, it was an illegal throw. Okay. And we're just forcing stuff back into traffic. I mean, this is not what we used to. It's a mistake. It's a mistake. Going on goal. Going on goal. Come on, come on, go, go, go. Heavy touch. Come up, come on, tough. Heavy touch. I tell you. Again, I feel that we're. You missed that one. Yeah, I missed that play. <laughs> <laughs> There's times when you watch you where I, I promise you, George, George saw that whole play. I did see it clearly. That's out of bounds. 
So we lost um, Craig Tdites. Craig Tdites going down to get some uh, some f on the field reporting. Uh, I'm sure Craig will be back at some point here. Again, we're losing the ball in the midfield. Oh, That's wow. Nothing wrong there. That was a great challenge. Wow. So, well, you know what? I mean, again, you, you can't. One call isn't going to make or break you, but uh, that's. Same referee. Yeah, no, that Same was. Same referee. He's playing soft. I mean, it, let the boys play. Jack Flaherty for Ashland will take the free kick. Senior captain. Nice header. Nice win. Nobody there. Michael Michael Tdites. Here comes Tdites. Go right to net. Go right to goal. Oh, someone be there. Tommy's ankle again. No. Yeah, Tommy Bukovalis is just, uh, he's struggling out there. Yeah, they just cramped up. Nice play by uh, T Dites. You know, made made uh, some deep penetration, had a nice shot on goal, and nobody home for Westwood. Do you give that up earlier? I mean, I you know, again, it's it's one of those tough plays. You you know, you get well, you did put it across. I mean, yeah. he held it, took a few guys on, and nobody was home. Nice through ball. No! Oh, man. So the that one was a tough one. Again, I don't know if his body was off. I and mean, again, that was great position by the official. So I'm going to give him the give him the benefit of the doubt on that. I did not think that was an offsides play. I think the ball might have been too heavy anyway. I'm not sure uh, T-Dites would have caught up to it. Nice step. Here we go, go. here we go. Go, Josh. Here's Josh Morrison Deutsch. Flick it. And yes. there's the goal. J yes. Josh Morrison Deutsch on Day senior day. night. That was a beautiful pass by Paravalos, led Josh. And that's how we have to exploit these guys. We have we have great team speed. So it's great to see Josh Morrison Deutsch, who has been snake bitten. Finally. Snake bitten this season. Uh, I believe he has one or two goals early, but uh, has really been pressing hard, and it's great to see him rewarded. Nice ball uh, up to Josh Morrison Dory. She beat the defender, beat the keeper. Simple game, George. So that was the first time that we actually caught them on the break, right? That is. So that's our strength on the counter. Again, Ashland coming right back. That's going to be, you know, no surprises on the far official. He's going to say an Ashland throw in. So 1-1. One, one. Most important important goal in soccer, number three. Let's get it. It's gonna be a throw in for Ashland. So 24 minutes and 38 seconds to play here at Flay High Field in Westwood. The 12 to 13,000 fans are still sticking around in this nail biter. Okay, don't play with it, don't play with it. Don't play with it. And there's uh, T-Dites. That's going to be a throw in. Oh, no, it stayed in. 
Nice English on that ball for Ashland. Nice, uh, nice recovery by Kevin Zhang. He was in the uh, on the wrong side of the the offensive player there, so you gladly give the throw in there. Bad throw, right in front of the referee there. She wasn't looking. She took her took her eye off it. It's gonna be a corner kick. Okay, so Westwood, let's see if they can dodge yet another bullet. Really like to see Westwood get physical on this corner and, you know, if there's a ball in the air, you're, you know, at all costs, it's gonna, gonna be your head that finds it, not one of the Ashland, Ashland offensive does players. Ashland a few uh, big boys, so let's be careful here. Nice ball, let's get rid of it. Through another corner kick. Again, our guys got pushed off the ball. Gave him another opportunity. We, we have to match up size. Jack. Jack will take another corner kick for Ashland. Some chip. There we go. Michael Moylan gets come in there at all costs. Here we go. There's Stavros Mikalakos coming up the left side. Give it to him. That's all. There you go. Beautiful. That's what we want, physicality right there. Yep. Right, and it's our throw. Yeah, and, you know, you, you don't want to see anybody hurt. It looks like the Ashland boy is hurt. But, you know, nice physical play, both players. Tip of the cap to uh, Josh morrison Deutsch. Tip of the cap to the defender for Ashland. They were running faster than I think I've ever run in my life. <laughs> faster than the speed of... Although I was fast right. one day. At, about, you know, sound like Al, sound like Al Bundy. Married with children. Back in the day. Back in the day, as he's sitting on his. Do you have wheels? Did you? Was that you, was that your game? Wheels I or had were you? Some wheels. Yeah. Absolutely. So substitution will be made for Ashland. A couple of substitutions. So 22 minutes to play. Time was stopped there. Throw in for Westwood, that's Justin Lowe. Peter Parabolos will control the ball for Westwood. Go from the back, get it over to Brian, Brian Gay. Nice job. And that is on, ooh, I think it might have been off. It's an aggressive play, but you know, you, we, we've, uh, we just scored on one of the similar plays, so take a shot there. Ah, uh, it's a little aggressive. Drew DiStefano, the only uh, freshman on the field for Westwood. Good cue. Nice job. Jesus. I mean, you know, I'm not, I'm not digging this, uh, you know, playing, playing from behind there. But that's a nice ball. That's a nice ball. Who's middle? Let it go. Beautiful. Oh man, he tried a one timer with his left foot. He did yeah, have a little time to take one touch and then slot it home with his right. Nice play though. I like that it. Was uh, a nice build up, right? That was, so, uh, that was one of those. You know, uh, you know, it was a nice flat ball across the box. Time just run beautifully. In the back, you, you know, you had some what looked like lackadaisical play, and then uh, that led into a nice ball all the way oh, down shot, the field. Starting to break them down. So. Tough kick. Peter Provolis. That's offside. Yep, nice job by Josh not going after the ball. Ooh, bad kick. Let's see if we can take advantage of it. Uh, don't let the ball bounce on the ground. That's a good ball. Uh, 
Don't wait on him. Don't wait on him. Be careful. Ooh. Nice job. <laughs> our heart was in our throat on that yeah. one. <laughs> that would have had that agonizing bounce over, yeah. over the keeper's head. And oh, oh here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Josh Morrison Deutsch again. Nobody there. Well. Oh. Oh. Josh Morrison Deutsch, another breakaway. Oh, goodness gracious. I'll tell you. Good defense, though, by uh, Ashland to come back into the play and make him make a quick decision. Absolutely, with the deflection. How did he miss that? Yeah. So you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna side with uh, He's Coach. He's missed Grant. a lot of. He's missed a lot tonight. Yeah. But I think he makes the same amount of money regardless. <laughs> I'm not sure. We'll have, have to, to we'll have to we'll have to Sad check to that say. with the MIAA to see if they make the same amount of money even if they have a tough game. I think they do. Now we've been tough on the officials this year and you know it's a tough game, but um, again that was a just do your job. Yeah. Oh that's a handball. Oh he got it! He got that one. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, did I say that out loud? <laughs> T Dites thought somebody was breaking uh, breaking in. Be a goal kick. So senior night, 18 minutes to play here. Westwood in a 1-1 tie draw with Ashland. Again, I was saying earlier, uh, Westwood Media Center um, located at uh, 15 Perwall Street. Uh, right over near, uh, right off Route 1, near Stewart Healthcare. Uh, if you haven't been down there, you're missing out. Uh, also, a shout out to Dedham Savings Bank. They um, gave a $5,000 grant for all nice sports. Ball. Nice job. Have a shot. Oh, and he gets taken down. Yes. See what we could do. I think uh, okay, she's coming in to see that. To Moreland with a shot here would be nice. So we've gotten the uh, keeper shaky a little bit here. So let's uh, put something on net. t Dites will try to go, I will believe, top left. Whoa. Oh, God. So what he wanted to do is he wanted Eamon Doherty to be on the other side, on the left, to, to side, left side to push wall. to push in and so that he yeah. could go around on the left. Well, uh, he, he didn't want him on the right side because that's where T. Dites was going to hit the ball, right? So he didn't want to make the wall larger. He wanted to make the wall smaller. Yeah, I think, I, think, uh, I think he pushed in, though, so I think he was trying to create some space on the other side. Nice job by Jack uh, Flaherty there. That's going to be too much for Ashland. Okay, so 15, well, excuse me, 16 minutes to play. 1-1. One, one. Drew DeStefano unable to control there. Okay, here we go. There's Eamon Doherty. Eamon Doherty coming out of the pack. Here you go. Oh! oh goal. Eamon Doherty on senior night. It's a goal. You get a goal. You get a goal. That was beautiful. That was a great run by Eamon. Is that his first goal of the year? I think it might be. At first or maybe his second, but I mean, that was just uh, certainly the prettiest if he has scored a goal. He just blew by two defenders. There were three of them back there. He, he, you know, they looked like they were walking. That was beautiful. So Westwood 2-1. That's a little bit more like it. There was no chance of that being called off sides as well, no, which was, uh, you know, he took, took it out of the officials' hands. So Westwood, you know, you get... Stay up. 
Nice job, Ryan Gay comes up the middle. Jack Flaherty. It's a nice ball to the right. Nice job. Nice job. That's Justin Lowe. Great job. I don't disagree with that. Get that out of there. Be a long throw in. So Westwood, just like that, 2-1. Two, two goals, two quick breakaway goals where Westwood now, and that's what we've wanted to see this year with the speed that we have. And here come the uh, girls' soccer team coming back from their uh, away game at Ashland. So oh, they're happy. That's another big W. You like to see that school spirit here as Brian Gay stepping up. Nice job. See, that's what you like to see. Just, you know, use, use your, your, play, your uh, teammates. Nice job. Nice. nice. That's a nice that's true nice ball. ball. That's through. Nice true ball. The T-Dites here. Nice play. Oh, man. It's going to be a foul. They, they oh, get, yeah. get a hold. So, again. This is dangerous. This is very dangerous here. Tip of the cap to that official. Made the right call there. So, he waited, you know, he gave him the advantage and called it, called it late. Yep, which is the right play. A lot of times, they uh, once they let it go, they'll they'll swallow the whistle. So two one, Westwood, T Dites will ask for ten, and this is easy because, and we got a timeout, Coach John Grant. So let's see what he has to draw up here. So uh, George, talk to me. A uh, big, sw big swing in momentum here. Uh, are, are the boys playing any more aggressive, or did we just get uh, you know two nice, two nice uh, breakaways? So what I'm seeing in the first half, we're doing a lot of small ball, Michael. This half, we're actually going a little longer and stretching the field and using our strengths, which is our team speed. So I mean, we need to do that a little bit more to keep these teams honest, because. They weren't giving us the time and space for the small ball in the first half. Yeah, and so I think you're right. I think from my point of view, we look at this team and, and there's, a, there's a perception that they can win playing small ball and they can control and they're, they're higher skill. But the reality is that hasn't shown through. So, so, so stretch the field. You know, there was a play down here where there's a little bit of a cardiac type uh, play where, where uh, Brian Gay and uh, I think it was Kevin Zang were passing it back and forth. But then right from the back, uh, you know, a long ball 60 yards down the field you know, and, and that's an example of stretching the field. Stretching now, if you just field. if you're kicking it with 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 no intent, right? You know, then it's then it's difficult. Yeah, you don't want to just play long ball every every chance. So what, you want to go side to side. You want to play some small ball. Suck the the, uh, the back the, defenders in. Yep. Suck them in a little bit. Then you go long and you beat them on the outside and you come across and you finish. Yeah, because so. the speed on this team, I mean, quite frankly, the, the, those two guys, uh, Josh right. morrison Deutsch and Eamon Doherty, they've got plus speed. Right. Um, Josh a little bit more. I mean, Josh has, yeah. has an absolute uh, burner. Right. Uh, and Josh has gotten, he's gotten you know, three breakaways, um, a little unlucky on a couple of them. I think there was one that was uh, clearly a deflection but was missed. Um, so I, I like what we're doing. Do you, do you continue to press up? Do you Absolutely. continue to Absolutely. try I to mean, put this fourth goal I mean, on the board? Start of our second half of the season. We need we need wins and we need to start clicking on offense. So we've got uh, Brian Gay, and uh, his strength is not typically taking a free kick. So they try to bring Michael T. Dites in motion there. And it just didn't work. Yep, but now we got to, okay, here we go. Just come up here, Justin Lowe. Get it wide. Oh, and he gets taken oh. down. Oh, we've got we've to get back. They've got numbers come up, up come here. Up, come up, come up, come up, come up, come up. Oh. Brian Gay, Brian Gay. Brian Gay getting in the way somehow, some way. That's okay. That's okay. And that's going to be a goal kick. So uh, So he fought all the way. you got, you got to be tough in there. Yep. 
that's tough because your keeper's coming up on you there, and, and, and you don't want to run. You, you don't want to run. How, how hard your keeper's coming, right? You don't want to run your keeper over either. Right. Nice flat ball. To Drew to Stefano. Send it now. Send it. Send it. Send it. Ah. There you go. That's okay. We okay. keep possession yeah. out. This side's open too. I give it to him. Give it to him. Give it to him. Justin. See, that's going to be quick one, two balls. Nice. Get it wide. There you go. Nice ball. Give it to him again. Give me a corner kick. Ooh, give him a goal Ooh. kick. Yeah, actually, I think, you know, that was tough to see from our angle. Um, I will not get on the official's case on that one. So 2-1, to one, 12 minutes, 38 seconds to play. Westwood with a one-goal advantage. Um, and, you know, I'll tell you, if you're, uh, if you're Ashland, you played a great game. Um, considerably better than they played in that first uh, matchup against Westwood. But um, as evidence in some of the scores, they're... Uh, you know, playing teams tough. Yep. You know? And it's all about game planning. Yep. And, and now it's the second half of the season, so they, they're making adjustments. Come across Michael Moylan, one of the three, I'm sorry, one of the two senior captains. Nice oh, ball. Oh, that's a nice ball. I think that might be a they? little too much. Yep. So Michael Moylan and uh, Tommy Bukovalis, two senior captains. Two of the 13 captain, or excuse me, seniors uh, out there for Westwood. Four juniors and one freshman. Ooh, that's a foul. Yep, that's a good call. Yeah, Jack Flaherty uh, held his ground. Michael Moylan climbed him a bit. Easy call. Jack Flaherty, a uh, teammate of my son Brian Gay at GPS back in the day. Solid, uh, solid defender. They've moved him up to midfield in this game. Ooh, get pushed off the ball. No shots. Nice there you job. Go. Gets back way into to, it. Way to win it. Yep. He's gone. He's Amy's gone. Here he, the is, here he is. Here he is. Here he is. One touch. One touch. One touch. Ooh, there nice you go. job. Great play by the keeper there. Yep. Oh, nice job. He knew. He blew past both of them. Again. Yeah, that's that uh, terrible feeling as a defender when you know you don't have the speed to to even catch up. No, he's Amy's failing it tonight. Nice job. Here's the Zanger coming up. Oh. Okay, here we go, Brian. Clear it out, clear it out, clear it out. Be tough. Just be tough and stand up. Oh, uh, she's going to give him a yellow card because he might have said a magic word. The magic word was said. The magic word was not. He thought he was. He, th he thought he was taken down in the box. It was incidental. Both, and both plays just just bumped into each other there. And he might not have said nice call. I agree. Well, if you're Westwood, you know, let let them take all the time they want. You got a two to one advantage here. Play by Jason Moore. I think he meant to flick it, flick it back into the field of play there. So that's a tough play, Brian Gay. I mean, you, you know, you you got a guy who has a, a bit more speed than you do. You're back there. You're just trying to get in the way. You get tangled. I think it was a good no call, but could have easily could gone have against gone West. Way. Could have gone against could Westwood. Gone either way there, and we've seen it gone the other way I know. against against Brian. So nice play, Michael Moore. Michael T. Dites. Nice. And just a bit yeah, offsides, no, but they're no. going to let it play. 
So Eamon was offside, but Jason was not, and Jason's the first guy of the ball. Oh, nice job. I like the way Westwood's playing. I mean, they're you know, playing with much more intensity here. Uh, not just evident uh, on the scoreboard where they've got an hour two to one lead, but. Watch this bounce. Yes. There we go. Bring it down, two guys right there. Back. Give it to Nice. Him. Yes. I like it. I like it. Didn't necessarily come together, but uh, oof. I'm going to call a. Uh, just going to give him a tongue lashing here. A little bit of a don't do that again. He's going to give that big Moylan smile. Try to get out of uh, get out of dodge here. Okay, and let's see. He has talked her out of it. Talked her out of the yellow. Yes, he has. It's the Moylan charm. You either have it or you don't, right? <laughs> Here we go. Dangerous ball. Okay, nice, nice job. Win. Connor Buckley, not uh, normally going up for the headers. Nice job. Drew DiStefano coming out. And that's oh, they call it a foul against the smallest guy in the field. Yeah, you know what? There was a little bit of contact. I think he might have breathed on him. and uh, Could have caused it. Here we go. Nice clearance. Here he comes. Here he comes again. Eamon is coming hard. He's coming hard. Whoa. Almost had it there. Nice job. Here we go. Get a header on it. Get ahead. Okay, uh, Westwood playing very high. Very high. Oof. I don't know. That's off. Be careful. That's no, off. that's on. Keeper's got to come out. Great play nice by job. the keeper. I don't like the line that Westwood, uh, the back no, defensive line, and playing way, there. way Two up. Two guys were onside there, right down the middle. And that's the thing. If you're going to have a line that comes up high like that, everybody has to come up. If one guy's Ooh. back, oh. you're... you're uh, that, that was a nice ball. Amy didn't expect it. So a frantic finish here. Westwood, one goal advantage, six minutes to play. Foul. They're going to call that every day. Yeah. Momentum just brought him into the player. Okay, now you got to mark up here. Mark up. Get inside position, Connor. Connor Buckley in the back. Get inside position. Nice job. Nice. Daniel Ventura. Here we go, Daniel Ventura is going to punt the ball. Nice ball. Nice play. Who's that? Ooh. That's Kevin Lyons coming out oh, of a... So it's a speed. I'll tell you, the, the back defense, since they've moved Jack Flaherty up to the midfield, they've got really limited speed yeah, in the back got, line. Slow. So Jack Flaherty, definitely a plus, uh, plus speed in the back. But you can't leave him back there right now. You, you need to score a goal. So I don't. Uh, where is Jack? I don't see him on the field. Actually, I think he might have even. He might might have gotten dinged up. So I think he is dinged up. Josh Morrison Deutsch. Um, Josh Morrison Deutsch is a very nice kid, actually, but <laughs> nice physical play. Oh, nice big long ball. Two guys there. It's going to be a throw in for, say, ooh, no, it's Connor Buckley. Saves that ball. Nice play. Okay, get a ball. There we go. Oh, man. Oh, this is dangerous here. Got to be very careful here. Set up a wall. Six guys. 
quickly. It's a third foul on Brian Gay here in the second half. Get a wall here. They need, they need more men. More men in that wall. This is dangerous for Westwood. Nice, nice job. Daniel Ventura kept the ball in nice. front of him. Didn't try to do anything special, just stopped it. Westwood dodges a bullet. Three minutes and 12 seconds. It's like the Red Sox game last night. I need, uh, I need some Pepto-Bismol. Nail-biting time. Yeah. Here we go. It's Josh Morrison Deutsch. Keeper has to come out. Have a go. Ooh, have a go, Connor Buckley. So under three. Two minutes, 40 seconds to play. Westwood looking to get the much needed two points. Tell you, this is a critical game if you're Westwood. Again, you, you know, you. Big switch. This way, Michael. There it is again, Josh Morrison Deutsch. Who's in the middle? Ball's Who's stay. Him? Someone needs to go forward. What's he calling? Offsides? I'm not sure what he called there, but uh, he was so clearly onside. Yeah. What was? I don't know. He called offsides. Yeah. Well, if it's offsides there, it's offsides at the 40. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that, it's, he was waiting for him to touch the ball. But doesn't know. But it's still offsides at the 40. It's not offsides at the 10, right? Yeah. Have a go. Good back to. It's going to be a throw in for Westwood. Nice. I tell you, the keeper, their keepers kept them in this game. Yeah. He's played well. He's come out, won his balls. Daniel Ventura has done a great job as well for Westwood. He's, uh, he's made some great saves on uh, senior night. Justin Lowe will throw the ball in for Westwood. Ooh, by himself. Ooh, I thought it was a handball. Thought I saw a handball. Let's go, boys. Finish the play. Don't jump. Here we go, Josh. Come on, here we go. What are you guys doing? Oh boy. Nice job. Nice win. Nice save. Who's in the middle? Good job by Josh. If they're going to shield you, you get run into them. That ball cannot bounce. We need to win those balls in the air. Again, shy away from the head up. Oh. I mean, that's the time where actually with your Kevin, uh, Kevin Zhang, you know, that, I'm okay with you putting the ball away there. You know, going in and not uh, not so sure about that I substitution. Haven't seen, I haven't seen Jack on the field. Yeah, Jack so. Flaherty must have been uh, must have been banged up, which which stinks. Yeah. Okay, if you're uh, Westwood here, we're, we got to be under a minute. Mistake. Send it. Drew to Stefano. Looks like Westwood will improve. 
in the standings. Not exactly sure what their record is, which uh, shows you how much prep I did for this game. But, five, uh, four, and one. Five, four, and one over With the 500 mark. So it'll be uh, a free kick or a uh, goal kick. We got another substitution. Peter Paravalos will come in for Jason Moy. So George Bukovalis, um, this has been a fun senior night. Uh, we were a little bit uh, in sour moods there with Western trailing one nothing for uh, in most of the first half into the second half, but they came back. Oh, nice ball. That's, that's gonna be another goal. That is gonna be a goal. Nice. And that's gonna be a goal. Michael Tedite. Nice. And that will do it. Westwood three, Ashland one. Westwood five, four, and one. Ashland will drop a heartbreaking loss. They uh, played really well. Uh, Westwood just wore them down. So uh, as senior night comes to an end, I want to thank Craig Tedites. Uh, he was down there. We, uh, we had some technical difficulties. We were ready to do a, a new segment, uh, the Roving Reporter. He was going to do some, uh, some, some in-game reporting, but that didn't work out. So for Craig Tedites, I'm Mike Gay, George Bukovalos. Actually, we'll wait till the final whistle. I'd say it's going to be about the next uh, 10 seconds. Uh, again, a stern come from behind win yeah. for Westwood today. Yeah. You know, you got to play 80 minutes. Yeah. The boys really opening it up in the second half. Nice job, Drew Stefano. Oh, it goes right by. Very <laughs> nice. Send him. Great ball. Great ball. Get in there. Oh, great play by Drew, the freshman. I don't know what the, uh, it's been two minutes for about the last five minutes here, so must have been some uh, injury time or some sort of time that the official was putting back on the clock, or maybe they stopped looking at their watch. So again, hats off to, uh, um, you know, Westwood, great win here. The seniors, 13 seniors, uh, Tommy Bukovalas, Michael Moylan, the two captains, uh, John Grant. It's going to be a nice, easy collection. And I'd say that that should just about do it. Uh, let's see if he punts it away, if that's going to be it. Over. Go, Josh. There we go. Yeah, you know what? The, the goals do count. Oh, mistake. Oh. <laughs> and that will do it. OK, so <laughs> this time it counts. So for Westwood Media Center, Craig Bugavallis. I'm sorry, excuse me, Craig Tedites, George <laughs> Bukovalis, I'm Mike Gay, Westwood, a uh, convincing, had him all the way, three to one win. Uh, so we will be back in action on Friday night against Dover Sherburn. Uh, on Friday. Yeah, you may see this game before. We're going to try to get it on, uh, online uh, within 24 hours here. But again, great senior night. Congratulations to all the, all the uh, senior parents, grandparents, brothers and sisters who had to put up with what, uh, what seems like a lifetime of soccer practices and uh, you know, early, early, morning, uh, early morning games. So I know from, uh, from my, my wife Betty and myself, it's been, uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's sad to see it come to an end. George. Uh, great ride. Yeah, uh, absolutely. I can't believe it's come. You know, if you, what do we have, seven games left in the season? Um, boys have really worked hard. And, uh, let's see how they finish. Absolutely. So, again, uh, thank you for joining us tonight. We'll hope to see you next time when Dover Sherburn comes into Westwood, where Westwood will look to improve on their 5-4-1 record. Take care.